guys, it's Thursday and I'm getting ready to go to my birthday dinner with my boyfriend. My birthday Sunday. We are going to Oku and I'm really excited because I haven't been to the one in Charleston. I've been to the one in Atlanta, but I've been wanting to go to this one for so long. Tomorrow night, I think I'm just going to get drinks with some girls. I made a little group chat and I think we're just going to go get drinks somewhere, but nothing crazy. I kind of wanted to do a low-key birthday this year. A lot of my friends couldn't come into town either, which really sucked, but I was like, then let's just do it low-key, you know? It doesn't have to do anything big. I haven't really done a step-by-step -step get ready with me on any of my YouTube videos yet, so I guess I can do it now because we have so much time. I love taking my time when getting ready. I can't find what I just put on my face. Oh. For the base, I did the Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk Hydrating Primer, and I mixed it with the Say, the Say Sun Glow drops, and then I did the Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk Foundation, and I wore the shade 5.5. It's a little pale, but I'm pale, so it's fine. It works. I'm probably gonna need to get a darker one, though, for the summertime, because I'm obsessed with that foundation. And then I just put the Tower 28 Beach Please Magic Hour Cream Blush on my cheeks. And now I'm putting, I'm going to put this concealer on. It's the Tower 28 Concealer. I can't, I cannot read the shade because I just need contacts so bad. But I love this concealer. I used to use the Hourglass one and I still do sometimes. But then I discovered this one and for some reason I like this one better, I think. I think. They're pretty even actually. I go back and forth between using a beauty blender and using the Hourglass Concealer Brush. I like both of them, but I've really been into this beauty blender. Now I'm taking the Hourglass Translucent Powder and I'm putting it under my eyes. I'm not going to lie, the beginning of this week I was a little sad. Because I didn't really have any plans for my birthday and it's sort of the first time in a while that I wasn't going to be with either my hometown friends or my college friends on my birthday and no one really talks about that your first birthday post grad and if you can't meet up with your people I have really great friends in Charleston but it's sort of kind of sad you know I was kind of in my feels about it but I decided to not let that upset me because I'm still gonna have a really great weekend. This Merit um, bronzer stick is so good. Not enough people talk about it. I've been ordering different equipment, content creation equipment. I don't even know what to call it. I ordered a bunch of lights and tripods and I got extra batteries for my camera. I got a new lens and I'm just so excited. I feel like I haven't been this excited to make content in a while i feel like on instagram i've just had a creative rut i don't know i don't really po take pictures let me know if anyone else feels like this but for a while i felt like whenever i would go to events or anything in general where i just would get dressed up and stuff i was more focused on getting in a good instagram picture than i was being in the moment about a year ago i just decided that I was not going to put so much pressure on myself to get pictures for Instagram, you know? And it's honestly been one of the best decisions ever. I just feel like I do love Instagram and I love taking pictures. I Sometimes I just felt like that was my main priority when going to things. And it shouldn't be. It should be being in the moment. And it's been great, but I also do want to get back into posting. Because it's been like a year and I'm just not... It hasn't been a year since I posted, but... It's been a year since I was consistently posting and now I post once every few weeks. With TikTok, I really like TikTok. It's just sometimes I feel like there's so much pressure to post three TikToks a day or the algorithm won't show your TikToks. And if I'm not posting daily, then I get no views. So I go through different um, stages where I will post every single day super consistently. And I'll do really good, and I'll have good views, and I'm, I'm just going, super motivated. And then I'll just get in creative ruts where I just cannot think of anything to post that day. And if I don't post for a day, even one day throws off the algorithm so much, and I just feel less motivated to make more TikToks. It's just, that's kind of how I felt with TikTok lately. I just feel pressured to be posting everything, and I don't like that either. 
So that's why I started, that's another reason I really like YouTube is because I don't feel like, like if I do a weekly vlog and I go to an event or something and I don't film that night at the event, I'm not like, oh my gosh, I didn't get a picture. I didn't get a TikTok. I'm just kind of like, it's fine. Like I have the rest of the week to get stuff. It's not that deep like it is on Instagram and TikTok, you know? Social media is a weird, weird place, but I really like YouTube. I can see myself being a lot more consistent on YouTube, honestly. The um, Merit Beauty highlighter is what I just use to highlight my nose, by the way, and it's so natural looking. I love it. It's so glowy. My senior year of college, I would do a lot of TikTok lives, and I loved doing them. They were so fun. Should I bring them back? Sometimes I get nervous to do them by myself. I like when my friends are with me. I don't know why. Do people do YouTube lives? Is that a thing? Should I do YouTube lives? Okay, I'm doing some Patrick Ta blush, the powder blush to go over the other. You can just never have enough blush. And also, I'm so bad at this, I'm just going and not even saying what I'm doing. But I took the Hourglass Ambient Palette and I took the bronzy colors and I used this brush and just kind of went over my contour on my cheeks so they're glowy. I'm now setting my face with the Charlotte Tilbury powder, the Flawless. I think it's, I feel like every makeup product has the word flawless in it. Or maybe just like every makeup product that I own. So my base is done. Oh, actually, I'm going to go back in with some more bronzer, some powder bronzer to set the cream one. I'm taking the Charlotte Tilbury one. I usually save this for summer, but we are just not doing that today. Okay, now I'm going to spray my face with some setting powder. And the base is done. I don't think I'm going to do anything crazy with my eyes. I think I'm just going to do bronzer for the crease and then mascara. And then I'll take this highlighting palette and I'll use these two. Just go like that. I might go finish my eyes and my lips off camera and then, and then come back. That's what I'll do. So, Ellie's birthday weekend. She's turning 23. <laughs> Jordan year. Let's go. Oh. I forgot to film because we were running late. Um, we're gonna go see Chuck. I'm so excited to see Chuck. This is the outfit I'm wearing. I don't really like it. I don't know how I feel. I was trying to do cheetah because the mob wife, the mob wife trend is going on. I don't really do trends, but I got this on Rent the Runway. It's a Ghani purse. I don't really like it. I don't think I like it. Okay, let's go see Chuck. I'm so excited. Chuck. Chuck. What's this light that I just got? Look, I just got this light. Do you like this purse? Oh, look at Chucks. Okay, why is it not focused? I think my camera's not focusing because it knows I'm wearing an ugly outfit. Hi guys, so it's Friday and it's so ugly outside. I'm I would show you, but then I think you'd be able to see where I live. But it looks like it's about to storm any second. So, yeah, that's great because tonight I was going to do drinks with some girls for my birthday. And I hate when it rains so much, but we're just going to make the most of it. It's okay. And, yeah. But today I've been working a bit. I, um, I just filmed a video doing my makeup. Oh, I just heard thunder. And my mom sent a cake. My parents actually are coming tomorrow. I think they're gonna try to surprise me, but then my mom just ended up telling me like, we're coming tomorrow, we have reservations. And she sent a cake here and I'm gonna go downstairs and get it out of the mail room. So I'm really excited for them to come. I'm gonna go get the cake from the mail room. I just got back from the mail room and I got this cake. So I thought I would open it. But I also got this Bondi Boost PR package and I think it's the thermal or the red light um, round brush. So I'm gonna open that too, I'm excited. So it came with these cute little happy birthday candles. Can not really see? Okay, actually I don't think I'm gonna be able to see it. Oh, it's gluten free, yo! This is it, it's in this, oh my goodness, it's so cold my fingers are like sticking to it. Oh. You know when you get like freezer burn and your hand sticks to something? That hurts so bad. Okay, so now we have to open up. I'm scared to pick it up again because it just burned my fingers. 
Oh, it's just like a coconut, like a all white coconut cake. And I think we're probably gonna decorate it before. Cute. Okay, I just put the cake in the fridge. Heat protectant spray. I'm excited, I've never tried the Bondi Boost or Bondi Boost. Or any of their products actually I've never tried anything so this is a dry shampoo and then and then we have the infrared bounce brush I'm so excited for this it is supposed to not cause any heat damage to your hair because it's like an infrared light it's red oh my gosh I'm so excited I'm gonna use it tonight I was gonna keep my hair straight but I think I have to use this this is it I'm gonna come back and do my hair with this Claire, what are you wearing? Um, nothing much. I think I'm not wearing to wear. I just don't know what to wear. I'm struggling. This is all I came up with. That's cute. This is gonna have to do. It's just cold. And like, this jacket doesn't look good with shorts. And I We're going to uh, yeah. vintage, lounge. vintage lounge. I was gonna say cocktail club again. <laughs> And everything that's, that could go wrong is going wrong. It gets storming right now, but we're just gonna make the most of it. We're gonna go have a good drink. Yeah, we're gonna have a good drink. And I hope that we can't bounce around though, because look, at, this is the weather. There will be no bouncing around tonight. <laughs> friends today. Yes. We have a car <laughs> laying around eating off the ground. <laughs> I know. Big dog. Oh, I know. <laughs> he is. He's supposed to be 100 pounds. Oh, it looks like those paws are huge already. Yeah. We, it's Saturday morning. Saturday we, um, we just went to Island Provisions and got coffee and toast. And now we're taking Chuck on a little walk to the battery, or around the battery. I don't know what we're going to do today. It's really ugly. At least it's not raining. This one's coming out. It's trying. Yeah, it's trying. <laughs> Oh, little, little photo shoot okay. moment. That was cute. Okay, come on. Maybe when he, by the time he's tired. Yay, the sun's coming okay. out. We're doing a live right now on TikTok. <laughs> we have all the lights. There's 30 people out here. <laughs> <laughs> last year when I was on spring break, like about this time last year, I did a bunch of lives in Cabo with Carson and Aww. all of them. It was so fun. I feel like there should be spring break. Even. For adults. Yes. <laughs> like that's when you really need it. It got quiet. What playlist is this on your Spotify? Charleston. Okay, I like it. Charleston girl. <laughs> like I wish maybe what I should do is just like go through your whole playlist and just make my own Apple Music playlist with this. Yeah. And like I wish I could just add just it get to Spotify and then no, save I it. I don't really like Spotify. I can't like wait for it like, to get warm. This is like the like summer song. Charleston, yeah, like summer song. Like I'm so excited. It's 70 degrees here today, and I cannot wait. I just don't have any like warm weather clothes. <laughs> Shut up! I know you do. Can I see that Mario palette on the Yeah. Ooh, it's so pretty. I feel like it's good for people with brown eyes because there's a lot of browns. Mm -hmm. Ooh, I like this. Okay, yeah, I can do that. Like, you know, like just like, <laughs> yeah. And then the ends are like all. Curly. I just get confused, like, what to twist. And then I feel like my, it's gonna get stuck in my hair. No, yeah. Okay, do it again. Okay. Do the twisting one again. Twist, 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 twist. Go all the way up. This one is kind of a bad one. Okay. This isn't a good example. Okay. Uh -oh. We can pull. Twist, twist, twist. Oh. Okay. See, and then it doesn't pull. So here we go. And then we just. This is a good one. Okay. <laughs> See, so roll up. And then we hold it. Okay. And then we pull inward, 
twist, twist, uh, okay. twist. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and then boom. Yeah, it's confusing. Know, it's confusing. I still get confused. Pull it down. Gosh, wait, I wish I got it on camera of Chase surprising me. Oh, yeah. I'll probably just insert it as like a clip. Yeah. But. We're going to bar 167 or 167 Raw Bar. And then my parents are here. And today's, we just got ready into the TikTok live. And then we're doing dinner tonight. And then Chase surprised me yesterday. Yes. And so I'm gonna, I don't know, I'm excited, but we're gonna have a little day. A little bit of a day. <laughs> Just us three. <laughs> See you. Hey, babe, go to hey. Yeah. I'll come home. Hey, hi. Hey, honey. Hey. Happy birthday week, weekend. Hey, birthday girl. Actually, I'll take that one. We'll just lay it right in the middle okay. of it. Oh, oh my God. God. <laughs> I'm so scared. What you do is record that you put the oyster down in the shot. I don't know if I can do this right now. Juice down in there. Here's the 23 years. Love you, baby girl. Happy birthday, Let's Ellie. Go. Okay, y'all take it. And then, and then I'll go. Oh! Look at me leaving. It's kind of good. It's so funny. It's good. I don't know if I want the oyster, though. I'm scared. Oh, you've got to take the oyster. There you go. Okay, that was actually really good. It didn't taste like vodka. Really? Wait, no. It tastes like a Bloody Mary. A Bloody Mary. Yeah, exactly. that was really good. It's actually really good, yeah. I'm surprised. I'll, I'll do another. <laughs> so we just had a late <laughs> So we just had a... <laughs> I can't even say it now. But my parents came into town and our dinner reservation is until 8.45. Yeah. So, How cute. we're Shelly, just gonna be drinking until 45, which is kind of scary. Hold on a second. There we go. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, not nice. <laughs> In the window. It's so cute. I go back home. Oh, I love lake pajamas. Should we all get matching lake pajamas? <laughs> Yeah, but you are. You parked kind of far. Yeah, yeah. You should have seen where you wanted me to walk from. Me and Claire are trying this new thing where we put bumpets in our hair. <laughs> we, we clip our hair up and we just um, got the blow dryer and sprayed, or not, what am I saying? I cannot talk you right blew now. blew it up into a mohawk. Yeah. Just gonna leave it like this for how long? Or just for like, I like, just totally feel like taking it out. Okay. We're glowing. Look at our bumpets. <laughs> Should we take them out? Should we? Okay. 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 Moment of truth. Big reveal. <laughs> oh wait, no, no, yeah. Oh, that looks really good. Wait, fix it. I feel like it could look good. I'll give you a little lighting. Oh. Okay. Did it? Okay. Kind of. Yeah. My hair was really oh, flat. My hair was did. really flat. Okay. Okay. Here we go. <laughs> Mine didn't do anything. <laughs> I think it's fine. Huh? Looks good. It should be just like stays like this yeah. and it doesn't throw a pot of hairspray in there. Oh yeah, that's a good idea. Perfect. Yeah. I should take this off and then do the silver one or should I just leave it like this? On this. It's like a choke. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> I like have to choke myself. Like minus the. Oh, I kind of like it. I think I like the silver. You like the necklace? Yeah. Okay. I have silver like, um, like the. Um, they, like they have fake bodega ones. Or yeah, the bodega. Yeah, yeah, he knows yeah, that bodega. 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 <laughs> yeah. Bodega. Like the, like the bodega. Thing. Where, okay. where are your I'll bodega picture. earrings? My bodegas. Bodega. Oh, I where forgot that I was putting those in. They're in here. Oh, this could be fun. Those would be really cute. <laughs> Not with the necklace though. Where are they? Where are your bodegas? <laughs> Wait, are they? Are they in here? My bodegas aren't in there. Here's my bodegas. Like. Too much I kind of like it. I like that a lot. Okay, yay. Do you have a silver purse? 
Oh, that'd be cute. I don't know. Let so me go good. see. I feel like we kind of all look like we're going somewhere different. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. We do. I'm going to work. I'm going to work <laughs> at like a school. <laughs> and Ellie's going to her birthday <laughs> dinner. Okay, this is Claire's outfit. Working with. <laughs> cute little black top. Some fun work pants. <laughs> Not actually. This is casual. <laughs> some cute booties. <sighs> we all look like we're going different. So I this is Claire's. I think we're boots on underneath. <laughs> <laughs> Sheeta leggings underneath. <laughs> I'm losing the dress. Chase oh is God. going to work. On a Friday day. Going to work. <laughs> <laughs> it's so dark in here, you can't even see. It is dark. Dang it. You it more for the white. Okay. Yeah, I guess that's true. <laughs> Shirt dress. Choker. It looks like a dog collar. <laughs> I said I like a French <laughs> 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 What are you doing here? <laughs> vlogging, vlogging. We're vlogging. We just got drinks at the Dewberry and now we're going to Lowland. Don't worry guys. Don't worry. Got I'm documenting. <laughs> You're just boom. <laughs> Lowland. <laughs> we both said that at the same time. You would like that place. It's a kitten. Oh. Quinte. Quinte? <laughs> we could. Can you see me? Yeah. Hey. <laughs> Lily, you look like you matched the restaurant. Yeah. I love the loafers. <laughs> hey, it's your mom. I love you so much, and you have the coolest aunt in the whole planet. It's your birthday. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm not. Hey, it's your mom. <laughs> Wish Aunt Ellie a happy birthday. Yeah. Hey. Okay. Hey, hey, it's your mom. <laughs> Hey Harry, Harry. Say hey, it's your dad. Hey, what's up? It's your dad. We're at your mom's 23rd birthday. <laughs> Happy birthday. Aww.